I'm blown away. I'm absolutely blown away by that. Sorry, I'm just getting a bit, uh, getting a bit emotional here. That was so stunning. That was something else. Today I am reacting to New Zealand music from Scribe to Shehard to Dave Dobbin to Nisian Mystic and everything in between. I have a grand total of 11 songs to react to. I tried to do 11 with my hands just then but I don't have 11 fingers. So the way the video is going to work, obviously I can't play the full music because of the various platforms this video is going to be on. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna to listen to the song, click my fingers, give you my immediate reaction, and at the end of the video, I'm gonna give you my top three. And we are kicking off with an absolute classic. Now let me tell you, the songs that I've chosen, there is a huge variety, a huge range across different eras, different genres, different times, different artists, everything but i'm sure i've missed some very important ones so get down in the comments below and let me know which ones to include for a part two but we're kicking off with one that pretty much everybody knows it's dave dobbin slice of heaven so wait there where are my headphones in they go i'm going to put the song on now click my fingers and give you my immediate reaction okay here goes okay that was cool. Yeah, okay, admittedly, I have heard that before, but to me, that is a song that is played when you're in a van, there's like seven of you, the sun is beating down, you're on a road trip, there's a crate or two, or five or six, in the boot of the van, you're on a long road trip, and you're on somewhere, you're on a trip somewhere good. That is a feel-good song. How can you not enjoy that song? If this doesn't sound too weird, I think Slice of Heaven sort of embodies everything that it means to be a Kiwi or to be in New Zealand on a nice hot summer's day. Or, as we say, classic Kiwi summer. So Dave Dobbin, Slice of Heaven, we're off to a flying start. Brilliant. Now for the next song, we're going over something a little bit different. This is Lord, a very, very well-known New Zealand artist arguably New Zealand's biggest artist in the world at the moment, if that makes sense. This is a song known as Liability. So here we go. They're in. Three, two, one. Wow. I'm actually genuinely a bit taken aback by that. I don't really listen to, sorry. I don't really enjoy pop music that much or chart music or original, I know, but that was absolutely stunning. That was, that was, I'm speechless. That was so gorgeous. What an incredible song. Lord, I misjudged you. I really, really did. I, I, I assumed, assumed Lord was all about these sort of catchy, poppy numbers. Liability, that is, that's heartbreaking. That is absolutely stunning. Yeah, I, I, that's thrown me quite a bit now, but Okay, on to the next song. It's time for a band called Shehard. Now, I've heard of them before, I genuinely have never heard any of their songs, but this is a band called Shehard and the song is called Home Again. So here we go, Home Again by Shehard. Okay, okay. Um, that, that is a song that I would have enjoyed much more when I was probably in my teenage years, you know what I mean? Bit of like teenage angst. Uh, it was it was good, you know. I like the guitar hook in that song. It was good. Um, I'll probably need to listen to more of Shehard's music to properly appreciate them. But that song, Home Again, that's definitely something that, as a teenager, yeah, I would have really enjoyed that definitely. Next, we have got a man called Scribe. Now, this song is called Not Many. I have heard a lot about Scribe. I've actually never heard any of Scribe's music until, well, right now, I guess. So this song is called Not Many. Here we go. Okay, nice, really nice. That, to me, is quite reminiscent of the sort of late 90s, early noughties Midwest rappers like Nelly and Eminem, that sort of fast rapping. I really, really enjoyed that. Scribe. Yeah, that was amazing. That was that was something that I can get behind. Again, I probably would have enjoyed that more maybe like five or, five, five or six years ago, but seriously, wow. Not many by Scribe, absolutely superb. Kiwi music so far is amazing. I mean, it's, it's a real mix, which probably feeds more into the fact that I've chosen a blend of songs, but yeah, well, Not Many by Scribe, love it. 
Next, we've got another one that is, of course, an absolute classic. I have heard it before. I've heard it before many times before I even came to New Zealand. So this is a song, Don't Dream It's Over by Crowded House. But of course, in keeping with the promise and the theme of the video, I do have to listen to it all the way through so that my reactions are genuine. So here we go. What can I say? It's a classic. It is the definition of a classic. Don't dream it's over. Everyone knows it. Everyone loves it. Now, I don't know if I'm going to be a bit controversial here, but I think Crowded House are both Kiwi and Australian. I don't, someone told me they were formed in Melbourne. or I don't know. I don't know. Correct me or in the comments or confirm that I'm right. I don't know. Please do let me know. But yeah, don't dream it's over. Crowded House. Come on. Everyone loves that. Everyone knows it. It's great. Next, we have got Black Seeds. And the song is One by One. So here we go. Black Seeds, One by One. Okay, that's my favourite so far. That is my favourite so far. Sort of reggae sound to it almost. That, I know I have, I'd heard of the Black Seeds before because, um, because they're a Wellington based band, I believe. But honestly, that was probably my favourite so far. Unbelievable. One by One, Black Seeds. Outstanding. Good work. Next up, we've got Gin Wigmore. The song is If Only. Here we go. If Only, Gin Wigmore. Lovely. Really, really beautiful song. Wow. That was a bit emotional, actually, to be honest. That was, that was really quite powerful. That was, that was beautiful. If Only, If Only, My Head Would Let Me. But wow. Yeah, wow. I really... <laughs> That really, really took me somewhere. Not to sound overly cringe, I guess, you know, when describing your reaction to music, it's impossible not to sound a bit cringe, but if only Gin Wigmore, that was, that was beautiful. That was really, really, really beautiful. It was, it was painful, like you could hear pain in her voice, but it was also kind of hopeful at the same time. That was, it, it was tortured and beautiful and great. I, I really thoroughly enjoyed that. Okay, three more to go. We have Sway by Bick Runger. I hope I'm saying that correctly. I'm really sorry if I'm not, but here we go. Sway, Bick Runger, where are my headphones? Here they are, let's do it. Gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. Sway, Bick Runger, Bick Runger. I'm so sorry if I'm saying that incorrectly. Please, please, please correct me if I'm wrong. That was amazing. Sway, Bick Runger, wow. That was beautiful. Really, really, really enjoyed it. I really want to find a song that I'm, I've not enjoyed. The She Hard one wasn't the best. I need to hear more She Hard, I think, to be honest. But so far, Kiwis, your music is incredible. Okay, two more to go. Now, this one I have heard before, admittedly. But again, I have to listen to the whole way through. Sun Goes Down, Nisian Mystic. Let's do it. Nisian Mystic, off we go. How can you not love that song? How can you not absolutely adore that song? That is summer. That is just summer. I'm speechless. How can you not listen to that song and have a smile on your face? Sun Goes Down, Nisian Mystic. That's incredible. That's absolutely incredible. That is genuinely my favorite so far. So we have one more song to go. And it is Hope I Never by Split Ends. Here we go, Hope I Never, Split Ends. That was absolutely beautiful. That was honestly, I don't know what it was, but that was so, I'm blown away. I'm absolutely blown away by that. Sorry, I'm just getting a bit, uh, getting a bit emotional here. That was so stunning. That was something that was really, 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 I wish I had better adjectives than really good and stunning and incredible, but Hope I Never by Split Ends. That was absolutely amazing. Jeez, wow, okay. I've now got to put these into my top three. I've got them all written down here in my incredibly neat handwriting, but looking at this, my top three, if I have to pick, okay, I'm putting in third place, I'm putting, oh gosh, I'm really quite overwhelmed by that last one. I really, really am. Okay, number three, not many, Scribe. That was amazing, that was absolutely amazing. Scribe, you're my third, you're my, you're my third favorite. Bronze medal goes to Scribe. Well done, Scribe. 
Okay. Second place, Sun Goes Down, Nisian Mystic. Nisian Mystic, absolutely mind-blowing. Loved it. But first, how can I not give it to Hope I Never by Split Ends? That was utterly mind-blowing. Please, I, I advocate Split... I urge you to listen to Hope I Never by Split Ends. That, was, that really took me somewhere. That was beautiful. Anyway, guys, so that was my first reaction to uh, some Kiwi music. I think that was 11 songs that I listened to there. Sorry if it wasn't the most entertaining. As I say, I can't really play the music, but I promise I listened to every single one of those songs all the way through and gave you my honest reactions. Please give me more music to react to. Give me tips for how to improve my reaction videos. I've just started them, so please bear with me. You know, it's, it's a work in progress, but honestly, wow. I am so blown away by the songs that I've just listened to, especially those top three, as I just said. Not Many by Scribe, Sun Goes Down by Nisian Mystic, but Hope I Never by Split Ends. Mind-blowing. See you on the next one.